Yeah, so guys, I just remembered we never got our money back with this dude. So, um, I'm using that gun. Jump and Jesus on get my money back. You're the first one to make it through alive, let alone manage a return trip. Yes, I spoke to him. I believe you said you would double my money. Yep. Here are your caps. Thank you. Um. You drive a hard bargain. Here you go. Okay, cool. That's for making me go through the bonus, and that's for making Veronica get hurt. 27. There. Yeah, that, that's because um, Veronica shouldn't have had to get hurt while doing that. But yeah, it, apparently, she's uh, returned. Should be. I'm not gonna, I haven't actually been to any of the strips casinos. Oh god. The vodka's worn off. To hanger. To the hanger. Where is um? What's his face? I am still doing that quest, right? Return to Jack. Let me just come inside for nothing. I feel I did. It sucks. Aha. Hello. It's great to finally meet you. Hi there. It's great to meet you as well. Oh, I'm well, glad I got you my made girlfriend. I didn't say that. You're even more stunning up close than you were at a distance. And you're even more handsome up close. Do you think it'll be okay if I hang? here for a little while so we can get to know each other better of course it would i'll have you set up with some quarters with some of the other women i'm um we may that was a bit weird janet to know us i've never been so happy in my entire life yes because that is the face of someone who is happy <laughs> can you think of any other ways i can help out like i said right. goodbye who are you guys thank you for getting me here jack is a Right. Uh, return to what's her face? To the back cave. Uh, so we've done everything for these guys. This is definitely going to be an hour's worth of content. Yeah, I tried on the boomer's cap, by the way. I was having a look through it. Um, found out the boomer's cap, and it looks pretty d like ball then. It's a beret as well, so that's what I wanted. So I don't have to kill anybody to steal theirs. Which is... Oh, can I troll some? I could troll pearls so bad. I could become an internet troll. Lol. Yeah, so, um, let's talk to old lady Pearl. Find out what's You have done up. well. Right, uh, well, I think I've done everything I can to help you people out. I believe the time has come for you to show your value in full. The people have come to accept having you around. Okay. Find Loyal and ask him about our people's fondest dream. All the B-29. He'll tell you what to do next. Thank you. That looks ugly. B-29, 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 B-29. <laughs> yes. One of the first games to actually have something to do with World War Two. And I think you can actually get a one grand in this. Garand. Grand. How if you say it? You can get one. I'm super happy. Oh wow. Um do that. And then you get You can't take mods off weapons either, which is really annoying. Talk for Loyal, who apparently at 9 o'clock at night is still inside the hangar. Boomers have a very long quest line.
Hello. Sorry, no time to talk, outsider. Some little patches. You must be decorated. Earl sent word saying it's all right to tell you about the lady in the water. A mermaid? A long time ago, long before the war that killed just about everything that ever lived, a bomber <laughs> be clear on again. A bomber was a flying contraption that could drop explosives down on anything it flew over. Thanks for this. But anyway, lesson. moving on. Well, I knew what bomber This was. bomber crashed down in Lake Mead, pretty damn near intact. When we got to Nellis, see, I found this article in a magazine all about it. There was another B-29 around here, part of a museum. Couldn't fly, but had a lot of spare parts, see? Get where I'm going? Since I was a young man, I've dreamed of raising that lady from the lake and bringing her back to life. What do you say? Where's the bomber located? It's at the bottom of Lake Mead. Okay. How do you expect me to raise the bomber from the bottom of the lake? And how do you expect me not to drown? Simple. Attach deployable ballast to the plane and float it on up. Here is a remote detonator. Once the ballast is attached to the plane, just hit the detonator from the shore and let buoyancy handle the rest. Right. Right, okay. Good. Here's the deployable ballast. Alright. But you still don't answer my question. How do I get to the bottom of Lake Mead without drowning? Because I swear to God, I will kill you if I do drown. Might try holding your breath. If that doesn't sound good enough, talk to Jack. He was working on a rebreather once. What? what? Why do you need a rebreather? Where's Jack? Why do you need a rebreather if you're in the desert? Just saying. I'm not being ungrateful. But why? Aha. Oi. Meat. I've never been so happy in my... Yes, the face of a happy person. Now apparently you can help me breathe underwater. I just need some parts from a pressure cooker to create a hermetic seal for the rebreather. Uh, all you need is a rubber hose, removable adhesive, some corn silk, and that should make a good seal. That's a brilliant idea. I can put that together right now. Here. Cheers. Right, let's equip... Oh, that's all my sunglasses. Oh, I'm a baller though. I'm keeping that on. Apparently, we're going to Lake Mead for some obscure reason. Where is Lake Mead in comparison to? Are oh, you mad? Oh, my baller city is closest place. We'll go there. Yeah. I don't get it. Why was there a bomber flying around Lake Mead? I, I, it doesn't make sense. I mean, yeah, it could have been coming in on an approach, but it's pretty low for an approach, don't you think? Well, yeah, this allows us to go into Vault 34 now, so we can get that special uh, car mine. So we can get one of these. But even better. I think it's another marksman carbine. Single fire. I think this is one of the um this is one of the only flying planes actually in Fallout. So you got the blimps that were made by the Battle of Steel. And that's it. the beach campground. I'm looking out for my alerts. I don't trust anything. Right. Where's Veronica? Veronica. Come on Veronica. Stop glitching. Okay. Companions are stupid. I do hate companions sometimes. Okay. Nope. You coming in? Yep. Nope. Eddie doesn't.
doesn't care. There's a boat. Not a B-29. Oh my god, that looks scary. Ish. Parts. Still no B-29. This game, Subnautica, anything, I just, I, I love it. Spider-Man, Spider- No, I'm not Spider-Man, I'm Aquaman. Aquaman! <laughs> I'm Aquaman. Uh, I can't use that, DC will probably copyright me, so... I need a new game. the B-29. Not as much as I love the B-17, but I like the B-29. Oh, I it. Alright, time to attack the ballast. I think there is actually a mod that puts skeletons in here. Yeah, I think there is actually a mod. How the guns? Guns are intact. Yeah, they okay. do. I mean, the bubble here is gone. Right, let's get to the shop. Before I try. Before I. Uh, before my cutlery on my belt turns stained and clearly stains on the package. Stainless steel. Ah, help, I'm being chased by a shark. I'm being chased by an eddy. Ooh. Ooh, lake meat's good for health. G2 HP. And... Oh, God. Dang, it's hard. Hey, 
may be annoyed if I burnt that. Right. Monica here? Yeah, you are. Okay, good. Check, because I know Eddie's here. He follows me everywhere. It's creepy. To loyal with bullets. <laughs> Attack on the other surface space, that would be cool. Bullets house. Really? So we may see our dream of flight soon? Yes. Good news, Loyal. It's going to be a dream come true once you've raised that bomber from Lake Mead. I wonder what the plane's name is. Because they normally have, um, names. That's tremendous. They? I'll transmit instructions to the robots to start packing up the plane to bring it back to Nellis. Robots. How would actually do you plan to get the plane back here? What, just with robots? I just told you, the robots are going to handle it. They'll break the plane down into pieces and move it up from Colville Bay in one shot. Okay. Won't that attract attention from the NCR? We've got that covered. It won't be a problem. Let's just say they'll be a little distracted for a while. Are you going to bomb stuff with your cannons? <sighs> oh well, let's help. Hey, I'd better get rolling. Jack and I have a lot of work ahead of us. Cool. Now this um, is all important because you can come here and do this all early on in the game. Get it done with. We can do it later on in the game. But later on in the game, you get a quest from the NCR to try and recruit the boomers to help them at Hoover Dam. Which I suppose. We probably have the ability to, but just come here and ask him now. Hello, friend. How can Mother Pearl be of help today? Right, B-29 is out of war. What you have done for us is a miracle, child. You have fulfilled the only dreams we ever had outside our walls. You are a trusted friend of us all. If there is ever a way for us to help you, child, tell me, and I will make it so. Thank you. Later. Oh, I got the achievement. Yay. A boomer flight suit. A boomer. Oh. I already got one out of it. Right. So. I want to progress further in the campaign. Now that's done, I suppose. The only thing that wasn't done is the doctor's stuff. And uh, since we're next to the staff, I suppose we can help him out. Finish all the stuff over here at Nellis. And we're good. We're done. Watch your step, sister. Oh my. I've just remembered. Where is it? Doctor's fatigues. I could have worn them and got the extra medical stuff. After carefully considering treatment options, you realise the patient is merely having a strong allergic reaction. By cleaning all the wounds of ant venom and administering a steroid com compound, you reduce the swelling and the patient's breathing returns to the normal. Treatment. I hadn't thought of that. If I haven't said it before, outsider, let me say it now. Welcome to Nellis. Word from Pearl is that you're to be greeted as a friend. Okay, thanks. Um... You've done right by us. So I said, we recently started making our own stim packs, but we just don't have the materials to make other meds. Okay, cool. So you have grenades, a grenade rifle. Thank you. 16 things. Go buy them all. Thanks. Okay. So, we're done. This is actually everything at Nellis Air Force Base done. 
over the two videos it's taken me to record all of this, we're done. We've done it, Nellis. And, you know, as a hard working man once said, once you've worked hard, you've played hard, you need rest. You need time to calm down. And I know the exact place. The place where we started. Home sweet home. This is sort of my player home at the moment. With the cosmonaut stuff. And I'll clear all this out for next video, guys, believe me, I will. So, yeah. We're done. Um, I hope you've enjoyed our trip to Nellis. If you have, like, favourite, subscribe. Um, consider leaving a comment for a chance to, well, be shouted out in the next video. Um, if you like Fallout New Vegas or Fallout 3, um, you can request for me to play that. You can request for me to play quite a lot, a lot of games, actually. So, thank you all for watching. And... Me, Veronica and Eddie, we'll see you all in the next video. Goodbye.